guys, it's me, Serenity, and today I'm going to be doing what is in my backpack. So, let's go ahead and get started. I kind of pulled everything out. So, this is my backpack. I used this last year. I had my flower backpack, but this was too, too, it was too small for the things that I had. So, I am using my backpack from last year. So, what I have in my backpack is one binder, two binders now. The Glass Sentence book, which is a really good book. And The Zodiac, I think that's what it's called. It's a Disney movie, so it might be good because I love Disney. So I'm going to go ahead and, I think I'm going to go ahead and just read a little bit. But I don't want to read a lot. Like, I'm not even going to, like, read. I'm going to read one page and, like, that's it. These are my bookmarks. I have eight of them. I got my scissors and my sharpener. So you guys are thinking, well, what happened to your flower book bag and why is it too small? It was too small is because I wouldn't be able to have room to put both books and I need both books every day because we have to have one, like at school we have to have one to read and like if I read, cause I, this is what me and Rose, Rosalind like to do. So like we'll read one book and then, then on the next block we'll read the other book. So it's, that's just how we, that's how we do it. So this is right here. Here's my pencil. I like using the kind of pencils now. They're just so fun to write with. Uh, this is my math, homework, and English folder. I have a pencil pouch. My beautiful coloring. It's beautiful. I worked on some of it. Oh my god. Oh, no, I'm not even going to deal with that. My homework folder. You know what? I'm going to have to because I'm tired of everything falling out of it. Alright. And that's it. And trap paper. And then here, of course, is a pencil pouch. Tip of confidence. Oh, you can't see that. Uh, this. 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 So. It just makes it bigger when I add more things in. So that's what's in there. And so now I guess I'll read. Oh, I'll read some of this. So this is what it looks like on the first page. Let's see how many. There's like parts of it. So when I flip the page, there's. Oh, there's not a lot. So when I flip the page, there's a picture. That's what it looks like. I'm only reading one page. Part one, convergence. This sounds like freaking that, like the divergence theory or something. Chapter one. There was something odd about the tour guide. She was tall. Whoa, I just saw it. He was tall with long hair, and she seemed to know a lot about Chinese history. As she should work, as she should working in the, what the freak, this is not me, as she should working in the museum. But as Stephen Lee listened to her, but as he, Stephen Lee listened to her, he couldn't, he, whoa, I thought that was like, mm. He, could, he couldn't shake to the feeling that she was quite what she seemed. The new China Heritage Museum first opened five years ago, the guide said. It was designed to resemble a traditional Chinese quadrangle house with several buildings surrounding a central courtyard. Well, that's everything, and I want to do some more stuff. So, that's all I want to read you. Anyway, give the video a big thumbs up, subscribe at the bottom, and tell me what you want me to do. Bye!